Dear friends, greetings in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. As we've gone through the year of 2024, we've been talking a lot about the future. We've been talking about the possibility of expanding the ministries of our church, adding on and expanding our facilities, and allowing the school that we've, we've started here to grow and perhaps expand into the grades of, of middle schools. We've been looking to the future but as I look to the future, I look back to the past, and I look at what we have built, what those who have gone before us have sacrificed and labored and given and, and worked for, and I'm excited and inspired by what has been, even as we look to what is yet to come. As we come to this, the end of this year, I ask you to do two things. Well, actually, it starts with one thing. First, pray. Pray for our congregation and pray for your role in our congregation. As we talk about responding to the grace of God in the only ways we can, by offering ourselves, our time, our talents, our possessions, I invite you to prayerfully consider what 2025 might look like for you and what you might be able to offer Christ Church, your congregation. And then I ask you to do two things, to look at the opportunity ahead as we come to the end of this year and to see if God has blessed you in a way where you could give a year-end gift. The other thing, and we're asking you to prayerfully pledge what you think you can support and what you think you can give to support the ministries of our congregation going forward into 2025. You can do this the old traditional way with a pledge card, or you can go online and there's an opportunity to do it digitally that way. Anything that you offer, whatever the Lord puts on your heart, we thank you for and we appreciate. When I, if you look behind me and you think back of the generations who've come before, it excites me to think of what God can do together today as we look to the future. Thank you, and God bless you.